I have always been fascinated with uh, with biology and, and how it, you know how life works and uh, uh, particular physiological processes that make life work. Um, so I went to school and got a degree in biology and uh, and then uh, when I met my future wife, we uh, we started preparing for marriage and. We heard about this NFP stuff, which I hadn't heard of before, um, and um, and I kind of it piqued my interest, but it was not an immediate response. Um, but slowly but surely, we eventually ended up in a natural family planning class, and I remember feeling like, wow, this is cool. <laughs> this is like really fun stuff to learn and to know. It encompasses a lot more than just uh, family planning. Um, so one of the aspects that really interests me particularly is that not only do you understand how to plan your family through the fertile cycles and, uh, and infertile cycles, but also um, you get to know your body better, especially a, a woman's body. Uh, better more than because um, we males are a little bit boring. We have pretty even keel hormones, and we're fertile about 24/7, and we're uh, you know we're pretty simple <laughs> in many many ways. And uh, and but women's uh, fertility is is much more complex and and uh, and has an interplay of hormones and and so forth that uh, are. If, if I could put it in a nutshell, they're, they're actually a sign of women's health. And so there's a aspect that is fascinating to me that it's actually charting your fertility can give you a good picture of what your health is like. Uh, and uh, given my biology background, that also played into some of my kind of like um, interest in health and, and human anatomy and physiology and knowing more about it and getting to know my wife's uh, fertility, her health. Uh, it got to the point sometimes that she would ask me questions about her physiology through our charting. So I just find that, that we miss the opportunity to know ourselves better and to know our spouses better um, if we don't try this. And most of the time the, the fear of it you know, the fact that uh, there's also, uh, yes, a higher incidence of, of pregnancy in people that have used NFP as opposed to um, contraception of any kind. Uh, but part of the reason why that is, it's not necessarily because the methods fail, it's because people choose to have children and they're a little bit more open to life, they're more open to uh, giving of themselves. Um, but one of the things that I think is the, the, the plus sign here is that uh, maybe the NFP does take you outside of yourself a little bit more. It makes you um, think a little bit more about not just your spouse but of the children that you might have and, and, that, and that commitment and effort and responsibility that you undertake. It makes us more responsible human beings. I think it makes us more communicative people. Um, it, it also enhances our knowledge about ourselves. I think the positives are so much greater. Uh, does it have you know, uh, barriers and difficulties sometimes here? Yes, because you know, sometimes uh, people get frustrated with the fact that they can't express their love for each other on a certain given night. But people learn very quickly how to express it in other, in other ways and, uh, and how to compensate for those la lack of intimacy nights uh, with filling them with something different, something new, and, and, uh, and it helps to keep their love alive. For my involvement in natural family planning and fertility awareness is uh, having read uh, Humana Vitae, the encyclical by uh, soon to be St. Paul VI. Uh, whom I admire uh, tremendously, but uh, the insights of that encyclical um, uh, about the purpose of sexuality and the, and the fact that the unitive and procreative aspects cannot be separated, and logically when we think about it, they can't, uh, then uh, 
um, that goes against everything that the world tries to say that you can. You can just do whatever you want with this. Uh, made a lot of sense and a big impact and, and actually probably uh, was a, a little bit of a, a dynamic um, you know, uh, force behind my pursuing more and more knowledge of, of natural fire planning and, and, uh, and it really complemented the physiological interest that I had uh, in, the, in the methods.